Hi, this is Philip with the Cynix Technologies. Today I'm going to show you how to install a Cynix search into Salesforce Lightning. But before we can get started, there are a couple pre-install steps that we need to take care of. Start by going to Setup. In the Quick Find bar on your left, type in My Domain. Having a domain is an important part of the setup process. Without this setup, your application will not load properly. If you do not have a domain set up, select Edit, set up a domain, make sure your redirect policy is set to Don't Redirect. Save after if you've done this step. Now type in Data Integration Rules. Enabling Data Integration Rules allows you to see your account or contact object on the Ascendix Search Map. To enable data integration rules, select the geocode that you want to enable and select Activate. Select OK. Now that integration rules enabled, Salesforce will update your records. Great, now that's done, we can start installing Ascendix Search. Select the Get It Now button. Install it into production or sandbox. In my example, I'll install it into production. Once you reach this page, scroll down and select I have read and agreed to the terms and conditions and confirm and install. You may be prompted to sign in again. Go ahead and log in. Once you reach this screen, make sure you select Install for Admins Only. Once the application is installed, select Done. Great, now we're ready to move on to the configuration portion. To configure a Syndic search, click on the App Launcher. Under All Items, select a Syndic search. Start off by accepting the license agreement. Once accepted, select Save. Now, click on Settings. Under Object Manager, Select the objects that you want to become searchable. By default, accounts, contacts, and leads are enabled. We'll go ahead and enable opportunity as well. If you want to enable ad hoc lists for the objects, select the checkbox under ad hoc list. And click on security to check which profile has the ability to add records to this ad hoc list. Once done, hit save. Now, if your record is mappable or has a related object that has geolocation enabled, select mappable and configure. By default, it's set to self and you can select the geolocation if it's self here. However, if it's a related object, select related object, select the object, and select the geolocation field. Hit OK and save. Now that's done, we can perform our first search. By default, we'll just leave it blank and it will search all records in the database. In this example, I have five records in the database and it pulls all five. To increase the number of records you can see on the list, click on the person icon here to activate preferences and you can enable up to 250 records per view. If you have more than 250 records, you can always scroll to the bottom to view additional records. If you wish to add a Syndex search to your ribbon bar here, there are two ways of going about doing this. First is going to setup. 
and in the quick find bar type in app manager. From here go into the app that you want to modify and select edit. Go into navigational items here and adding a cynic search. and hitting save. Alternatively, you can also use the pencil icon here to personalize the nav. Go to add more items, click all, add a syntax search, add a nav, and drag it to the location of your choice. Hit save. And now a Cynic search is available right next to the Home tab. Thank you. And have a wonderful day.